Hello everyone and welcome to I'm already falling down. Welcome to pain, suffering. Also no es la mula en esto. I'm Ranyakuma, that is here with me to watch me suffer as usual. And today we're gonna go through hell. And find hell. To beat hell into the pulp. Probably not today though. Anyway. And there and are... will you grow. Yep, there are different ways to figure out what the right order to do this thing is. One is to just uh, learn like the order in which you lose items and just figure what's required to enter each door. For example, the second thing you lose is the grapple claw. So clearly you should you enter you should enter the guide that requires the grapple claw. Makes sense. Yep. Also, you can crawl through here. Why did my weapon change? Did you derp? Hey, lava hot. Yeah. Now, I do have a list reminding me of all of these things. So... Let me check here real quick. Oh, right, yeah, that one's pretty obvious. Then we lose his armor. Guess where we need to go? Sounds about right. This will make an extra save. You know, just in case. Yeah, in case that happens. <laughs> in case you done goof. Yes, exactly. So this is me. I bad. Aims out to get ya. So it seems. Oh, well, C6 should be. Now here, remember this place? No, of course you don't. I mean, this whole area would eat, is easy for me to get my stuff in. Yeah, this is where we got the bombs. Okay, it should be this one. This leads here. We need to kill Crystal Girl to unlock this. And we lost the we lost the wings. Yay! Yay! Wings. Yeah, the 
the feathers. Oh, feather. Uh. <laughs> and you immediately tried to jump anyway. Sorry about that. Anyway, I think I might... Yep, I... You say it was loud, but I didn't hear nothing. Oh, good for you. Anyway, I, I had expanded open on, in the background, so... My gamepad was doing two commands at once. <clears throat> anyway, uh, oh, I wanted to go over there. We used bombs to break open that rock. That was on the other side blocking that pillar. Yeah, it's because otherwise we would need double jump to get here. Hmm. Makes sense. And there it goes there. Mm, I feel like that. Oh, this is where you come out after you fight the doppelganger, isn't it? Yep. Fuck off. But well, now that's open. There goes the glove. <laughs> so kind of weird since say. this should open up. Uh, oh well. Maybe I'm missing something I forgot about. Well, like it matters since I'm going to go and do the safe option and go through this. You yeah, get you all your stuff thing. back. Oh no. 
Mm. I'm glad I made a manual save. What did you do? Remember how there's a specific way to activate a Holy Grail? Which requires actually reading them? Oh, that's what opens it. Of course it does. <laughs> hmm. Yeah, I couldn't teleport back because I was a donut. Extremely frustrated for the next good while. I think I'm gonna make another manual save here since all we did was get our stuff. Ah, it's nice to have it over you. Anyway, you go over here, kill the lasso. There's hell. Yep, there is silent deal. So. Missing an entry still. Two entries. Hmm. Oh well. And it doesn't say what race she is. A child born to the three of the, the six. Oh, it was six children. I'm fucking stupid. We know this already. <laughs> Half her body was dead and rotten from birth. Due to this irregularity, she was chosen to be the ruler of the underworld. With the end approaching, she has strengthened her hold on the underworld and is able to return those who have fallen to the underworld back to the world of the living. Odd it's the six children when Loki, the trickster, is a frost giant. Uh, no, no. Hmm. I mean, Lors, La Milana lore speaking is probably different. Yeah, that... Mm -hmm. So I'm not sure they ever call him Loki directly, they just call him the Trickster, but... Mm. Yeah. Welcome, she who has overcome the trial of the Seven Gates. I allowed your ability to reach this place alive, and without the Mother's power too. I shall grant you one mm. wish. So, little one, what would you ask of the underworld? I'm leaving. So that is your wish. Carefree, naive little one, I shall send you to the world of the living. Okay. <laughs> I'm going to exhaust all of the options, of course. Mm -hmm. I just wanted to check this place out. I see. Then your wish has already been fulfilled. The very act of a living being standing before me is a sin. You shall be punished. Uh. Yep. Okay. Just insta kills you. Mm -hmm. I wanna kick your ass! Oh, pathetic little one. Do you know what my, my death would bring me, Glana? If you wish for the end, then I shall grant you an opportunity.
Ah, that's an interesting fall spike mechanic. Kinda of giving you a royal thrashing. Yep. <laughs> She's just like, nah, I don't think so. This gun works on her. Yeah. Silver lining. I'm not even going to bother trying the lamp of time. I'm pretty sure the devs figured out people were teasing that. They're like, nah, you must suffer. Hey, at least I'm getting her down to the red health bar. I should probably go buy some okay. more ammo. It does help if you shoot in the right direction.
It's so hard to find a good. I guess I could have used flares. But wait, there's more. Like in case, in case you didn't pay attention Fuck the first it. time, Thanks. that gun did not deal nearly enough damage to finish that health far off a minute ago. Yep. Oh, that didn't take me nearly as many tries as I expected. The journey is nearing its end. It no shit. I applaud you, little one. It seems as though my role has been fulfilled. The ancient children who fight meaningless shall meet their end. May the final child of power welcome a new future. Hmm. Well, you know what time it is. Actually, first of all. Book of the Dead acquired. Hmm. After all this time, it reduces the effect of life sapping attacks. Okay, life then. But anyway, looks a bit different now, doesn't it? Information DIE! <laughs> yep, that's a thing. Alright, I can just wipe out now. Oh, I just realized I don't have the map for this area. Huh. I don't need a map, it's time to go. Yeah, I'm just kinda surprised. Oh, oh, never mind, it's not that I don't have the map. I even equipped the map. You don't have the map enabled. Yeah. Minor little shimmer. By the way, it's time to go. It's time to leave. That's our for it. One thing I accidentally did over in Valhalla? No. You've done an awful lot of things for me to remember one specific one without specifying. Fair enough. Oh, I think I know, know though. Yeah, Yo. that thing. Angry beam of light. We're gonna do that thing a few more times. That one was already active in the right direction. Nice, nah, bloody in all directions. Oh, yeah, I could have used the girl figure. Uh -huh. Oh well.
get them again. <laughs> Friendly fire, it is enabled. it off. I did take it off. Oh. Only one move. Only one left. Which is of course. Why do I can help? Good to know. We keep access to the to the holy ground now. And now that happened. As expected, you can't really use the block corridor anymore. Gee, I wonder mm. why. But well, it is one soul gate we haven't used yet. This fact, according to the data you've gathered, this should be the final door. This is where the ninth child and the mother's final creature sleeps. If these ruins were constructed in the same manner, manner as Lamulena, then that means that the embodiment of the mind of Eglana should be lying in wait, in wait somewhere deep in the center of the ruins. But the main difference with Lamulana is that Eglana itself has already awakened. And it's utterly furious at this world for destroying its mother. We cannot enter this gate. It seems that it can only be opened by one who is both free from the mother's bones and has harnessed the mother's power. I believe in you. I will wait. But nothing from Mulberg? Hmm. I can't really help you out, but I'll be waiting. After you take out the nine child, your planet's power should also die out with it. We will be able to enter too. Once that happens, I'll be there. Now hurry up and get out of here. None of that history or mankind stuff matters now. We have to make, make it through this. Hmm. Anyway. Yeah, figures. Secret, secret treasure of life. The secret treasure of life is the physical crystallization of the power of the mother, who was the true form of Lamulena itself. Your father took it back with him when leaving the Lamulena rooms. He too is here in Eglana, isn't he? Where is he? I can't really help you out with that. Oh. Uh, another thing from her. Well, time to look for some shit. Assuming I remember where to look for that shit. Red. Everything sparky and stuff. This is something. That can't be. <laughs> huh. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Apparently, she's in two places at once. Peters. Never more, bro. When are you going to share that trick with us? 
She's just faster than Hang on. And Jeds weren't here. Are those? No. You could say it's starting to get a bit chaotic. You could say. Falling into dissonance. I'm not apologizing. Went a bit too far to the other one. Sorry, your research papers are fired. This one we technically oh, actually have to be. Sorry, thank you. I'm not done, but I mean, feel free to post a video on Reddit if you want. There's uh, a lot of load. Huh. There should be one at the end basically saying what happened to them. But I'll just make things easier. The the look up I took them. So of course. What's what's his name? Big bad wannabe Indra. Yeah. Also, Indra acquired. Speaking of Indra. Leader of the local polar race of the sixth children, Indra desires to rule over Eglana. The local Pala are not so bright, unaware of Eglana's various secrets in history. Indra simply seeks power, but his storm-based magic is not to be taken lightly. He uses a secret art to pull the beating hearts from live sacrifices. Not the most pleasant of people. I guess I'm missing his research paper or something. That's where he's supposed to be. Really? Um, does, does it happen if I go in this one? Nope. So I'm missing something and I forgot what. Let's go talk to the Fairy Queen. There also wasn't There's a local pilot there. There wasn't hostiles at all in there. Mm -hmm. Do you remember the trickster of Yggdrasil? We all for created him from the course of one of the giants known as the Jotun. There you go. <laughs> then we found in the shrine of the frost giants. We inserted him into the water between the Aesir and the Vanir for the purpose of spreading chaos and discord within Eglana. His very existence was part of the plan to seal Eglana. So, yes, but actually no. That's the head you have. I had entrusted it to Arsetana to hold on onto till the time came. It was originally a tool used to activate the corridor of blood. In order to seal off a grana, murderous intent directed at the mother is an absolute requirement. For those of us under the mother's influence, harboring the seal intent is impossible. Now the soul of the street style of Yggdrasil is contained inside that beheaded. It has fused with, with the anchor and combined with the dissonance released by the guardian souls. Collect the dissonance of the five races and the underworld, and the Beheri will manifest order as intent, making it a key to seal in the mm -hmm. I kind of already figured that out, but okay. I have lived here inside the Eglana ruins for tens of thousands of years in order to ensure that mankind is not destroyed again. Please do not take pity on me. Our values and ways of thinking differ from, differ from yours. But traversing the outside world with your father when La Murana was sealed off is one of my most precious and wonderful memories. If Eglana is also sealed off, 
then I may be able to see the outside world once again. Okay. And that's kind of bad. Well, I do remember one more thing we can do. I'm not going to enjoy it, and I doubt this what we need to do for that to work. But I might as well do it. see the markings so mm -hmm. the lines just going through the world. Mm -hmm. <sighs> Hello there. In case you had any doubts, oh wait, it actually works on him. Okay. Of course, his job is merely to herald the end. He's nothing special. I don't think the lamp of time would actually work on him. But well, that's the end herald there. And like that, we've just begun a Ragnarok. Pretty much, yeah. No, let's heal first, just in case. Is about to get a lot worse. That's a word for it. Please, a bit of a long episode because I just want to actually go through that door. Is something different. Mm. Or the look up a mm. Well, I guess that was what we need to do. Let's check. Let's go through the other door so we can make our daring escape or rescue, I guess. <laughs> and you know, not flop on the ground like this. <laughs> I think I'm actually completing this a lot faster than last time because last time there were other enemies showing up in basically every area mm. Anyway Yep Now we got it right The treasure of life acquired. Bye. Did you just drop the cage on him? Pretty much, yeah. <laughs> the grass, motherfucker. I'm going to take the safe route. Yo, there's a local pilot in the tent. Yeah. 
I, I think that was also supposed to be the other indicator that they got captured. Yeah, I really used to the same thing again. You know what? Whatever. Not fast enough! Clearly. There, fixed. Would this make a difference? Probably fucking not. I should also probably go refill the Copa Soma. Welcome to Spiral Hell. Next time. Oh god, not that tentacles again. So yeah, I hope you all have fun. And I hope we'll see you next time for absolute fucking suffering. It's the Hell Temple again! Yeah, except with slightly better mobility. <laughs> Uh, no, no, it's not quite as bad as the Hell Temple. That's the upcoming DLC. Huh? Anyway, bye bye.